Heart attack and stroke rank as the number one killer of Americans. Yeah, check out these numbers here. In the U.S., someone has a heart attack about every 40 seconds, and on average, someone dies of a stroke every three and a half minutes. Now, this month marks World Stroke Day, and there is an effort underway here in Cleveland to bring attention to the dangers one pedal at a time. News 5's Tracy Carlos explains. Roughly every 40 seconds, someone in the United States has a heart attack. The American Heart Association says in 2019, someone died of a stroke every three minutes, 30 seconds. For Jackie Yoder, those numbers are not just statistics. I'm having a hard time breathing. At just 41 years old, her husband Kyle died of a heart attack. Two and a half years ago, Kyle was outside doing yard work when he collapsed. I can't catch my breath. He's like, can you go get me some more water? So I go in, I get him water. He comes out, he's sitting down and he sat down. And the next thing I know, we're just talking and he, the glass drops out of his hand and he collapses onto the stairs in front of me. Jackie's life changed in an instant and and that changed my involvement. Kevin Sloan was Kyle's friend. Their daughters became fast high school friends and soon the families formed a deep friendship and that changed my involvement. Now he's taking steps to keep Kyle's memory alive. Took my involvement to a whole nother level and made my involvement much deeper. The key bank executive is heading up a team for the American Heart Association's Cycle Nation. Cycle Nation is in its fifth year here in Cleveland. Teams keep a bike moving for two hours, rotating on and off, all while raising money for the American Heart Association. I think, unfortunately, just about everybody has been impacted by stroke or heart attack in some way, either directly themselves or a close family member or friend. This year, Cycle Nation Cleveland is on the day Kyle Yoder would have turned 44 years old. Now for the first time, Jackie will take part to raise money, awareness, and to keep her husband's legacy alive. I just wanted to do something to honor him. Uh, he wasn't forgotten. The Cycle Nation will take place here at First Energy Stadium on October 27th. If you're interested in taking part, there is still time to sign up. We have all of the information on our website. In Cleveland, Tracy Carlos, News 5. All right, Tracy, thanks. Cycle Nation Cleveland hopes to raise $250,000. So far, it has raised $150,000.